Dragon Ball in one minute, the first one. Balls, Dragon Balls, collect them all, get a wish from the dragon. Bulma wants a boyfriend but doesn't have all the balls, so she gets a naked kid named Goku. Cool tale, though. Goku has a ball, his granddad's, he's dead. Goku and Bulma team up to find the rest. This blue guy wants the balls, too. He's only got one like Bulma, though, so he just lets them do all the work. They meet a pervert who gives them a ball in a cloud that Goku can ride. Cool, they scoop up some team members and the rest of the balls. Blue dude steals them. He tries to make his wish, but this pig saves the day by being horny. Whoops, Goku's a great ape. That's probably not good. They cut off his tail and everything's fine, though. Now that the plot's over, Goku's like, guess I'll be a fighter, and trains with Master Roshi and some bald kid named Krillin. They go to a tournament and Goku transforms again. Roshi blows up the moon to stop him, but that's whatever. Goku defeats an army and discovers Sensu beans. Now he's got to collect the Dragon Balls to resurrect this guy. This is taking too long. Let's skip a bit. Whoops, Krillin's dead. Piccolo wants the ball, so he fights Goku. Whoops, Roshi's dead. Whoops, the dragon's dead. Goku punches a hole through Piccolo, which makes him lay an egg and die. Goku meets God, who resurrects everyone. Goku trains with Mr. Popo. At the next tournament, he clobbers this girl, Chi-Chi, and they're like, let's get married. Goku and Egg Piccolo fight, but Goku's like the most powerful being ever now and wins, but he doesn't kill him. Piccolo calls Goku a soft boy and flies away, but the story continues in the next 800 series of...